Are you looking for easy and inexpensive teacher gift ideas? Hey, special educators, this is Jennifer from Positively Learning, and I've got you covered. Now, this is not my typical style of videos, but I did want to have this information all in one place. So I'm going to quickly walk through these ideas, but no need to take notes because I will put links to each of these blog posts that has more details and some free downloads included. I'll put these in the description so you'll have everything there. All right, the first two gift ideas are for the holidays, and the last two can be used anytime you want to show appreciation. Now, I will say, I always worked at large schools. So, for example, there may be six homerooms per grade, and as a special educator, I was like the seventh classroom. And then you add in paraprofessionals and related service providers that we work alongside, and it adds up to quite a few gifts. And I didn't exactly have time to spare or the budget. So here's what I came up with. The first one um, is a set of these cute, adorable little chapsticks. Now, I am not crafty, but I can hit print and I can assemble things. So chapstick was the gift. That's what my budget allowed. In fact, I bought these chapsticks in bulk. I would have loved to have gotten the cute little limited time flavors like candy cane or gingerbread, but that was out of my budget. And I don't recommend buying chapsticks individually like at Target or Walmart, if that's gonna really add up. But instead I bought them in bulk and I left a link there if you want to find out where I got them. And I got this printable, which is free. You don't have to sign up for anything. You could just print it right there. I chose to use cardstock because that was just a little more durable. You could print these on holiday colors or assorted colors. And then I did a hole punch with ribbon. And then I assembled it by adding tape on the chapstick and just signing the sweet message at the bottom. I put these all into a gift bag. And then you could go to school and hand deliver them or put them in teacher mailboxes. Or even better, you could have a student walk around and deliver them to teachers. So that was a cute and easy idea. And I think everybody loves chapstick. Now, another idea, and this might seem familiar if you've been following me for a while, you know that I love sticky notes. And I have a set of 300 sticky notes. I have the link in this blog post. I think they're $4. And out of this set of 100, majority of them can be used any time of year. But I also have included seasonal and the major holidays. So in this picture, you see the winter sticky notes. And those would be cute leave with a quick homemade treat, which I do not bake. So I always go and leave K-cups. It'd be cute if they were hot chocolate or some kind of holiday coffee flavor. But you could also use them with school supplies or some little candy treats. All right, so that is another quick idea. The next one is a set of these free secret snowflake notes. Now, this is a set of 24. And the reason there's so many of them is many years we would have a secret snowflake, which is where you draw the name of another teacher and you have, you've got to act sneaky and leave them little treats. And I think we had a cap like dollar a day or something like that. So I made a bunch of these little notes. Some of them can be used anytime, like the Joy and Noel, these little gift tags, but others were a bit more teacher specific. And I mean teachers in December specific, like, we're almost there, two more days, you know, those types of messages. So be sure to follow the link and download these so you have them. You could use them as gift tags or those sweet little notes. Okay, the next one, I actually do have a whole video on paraprofessional appreciation ideas. I'll be sure to link that up at the end. But I wanted to show you these sticky notes. Now these would be great for the holidays. You could even print them on red or green sticky notes if you wanted, or you could use these any time of year. But I like to leave these sticky notes. You could leave them with a treat or another school supply out of sticky notes, or you could make a sticky note display, which would be so fun to have, and I'm sure it would show your appreciation. All right, the last link I'm going to put in the description is kind of a catch-all. I've written down several ideas for teacher appreciation that you can use any time of year or that first week of May that's designated to Teacher Appreciation Week. And I have lots of different ideas from the very 
easy gift ideas, practical, thoughtful, and personalized. Now, personalized isn't necessary, but it is awfully sweet if you want to do a little bit of a larger gift. And you do want to plan ahead, though. So I would say, I don't know if you'd need a whole two weeks, but just to be safe, I would order these two weeks in advance. And I'm showing just some examples from my Etsy shop. Um, these are specific to teachers, but really student teachers, paraprofessionals, and special educators. So there's some cute ideas there. All right, I hope that helps. Be sure to go to the description so you can grab some of those ideas and download the freebies. And be sure to hit subscribe because I will be back next week with another video for you. Take care.